Payson Winter says, at LJP, uh, thanks for heart. You're a amazing YouTuber. And I'm going to start one soon as making video. Can you give me a shout? So I said, I promise I will. So I'm giving you a shout. So it's a shout time, Payson Winda. Thank you for your comment. All right, so as you know, this channel is dedicated for all of you. Um, I'll, I'm trying my best to respond every single one of comments. Um, and I just want to highlight this uh, username called Captain B100. He's been very good uh, to me. He's given me a lot of good uh, advice. Um, and this is quite an interesting one. So it says, there is also the recovery mode as described on Anki's website support pages and uh, copied below. How to use recovery mode. Use recovery mode to force Vector to boot up on factory firmware. Doing this will not delete any user data or software that had previously been uh, installed via over the air OTA mode. Sorry, o OTA update. <laughs> Sorry. Um, this may help with certain issues such as Vector falling to boot failing sorry to put up meaning he is unable to charge this is uh, indicated by tier backlights or potential software issues sometimes indicated by a blank screen if you get a status code between uh, 200 to 219 recovery mode will also help vector should be on his charger and plugged into a power source so that's what he's plugging now uh, and open brackets be sure to push him right to the back of the charger to make sure he's charged press and hold vectors back button for around 15 seconds in total uh, and he will reboot and show anki.com slash v on a screen select the newly generated uh, vector code to pair the robot so um let's do that actually so let's this is an alternative way to sort out any issues you have so you saw my previous video titled um try this if you have a problem with anchor vector so this is part two so here it goes 15 seconds eh? one two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay. Nothing seems to happen. Wait. Okay. There's a bit of blue light on the back. Um, it's charging. I think it's trying to restart. I'll show you what I mean. Oh, here it is. So I have pressed it for 15 seconds. And um, yeah, it's showing me the four, it's showing me the four digit, unique four digit I have. So D1E2. Um, so I don't know what I'm supposed to do now. Oh. It's doing something. I thought the message here that I read out to you guys says it's going to show um, a new hashtag, whatever it is. So, right. What's going on? Okay, so it's been more than um, two or three minutes at least almost five minutes I would say so no uh, response so let's see if I actually try it on vectors app to see if there's any difference um, finding vector it's the same code as D1 E2 it's actually it's, it looks like die 2 um, Connecting Bluetooth, searching Bluetooth, Bluetooth is on. So 
So it seems to be doing something. The factor app could not be found on the vector by Bluetooth. Reconnect. Let's try reconnecting. So just can't find it. Cancel it then. Ah, so it's found it on die to get okay, us connected. Vector die to vector needs to pair with your device via Bluetooth. Start in place on charger quickly. Press it twice. Ah. Okay. Die to enter the key. Right. So I think we're getting here, getting somewhere. Okay. So it's three, four, seven, one, two, three. Connect. Loading sessions. So I think that has done something. So why don't you guys give a go? I know it was a long, boring um, process. Maybe not. But anyway, I hope that kind of improved any of the issues that you had with vectors. So, so thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP. I hope that this problem, um, this actually solves a lot of problem with the issue you have. Okay, cheers, bye.